Erotica 7 for my husband, Kirk. I want to make love to you like poetry. I want to slide my hands across the canvas of your skin the way I slide them across a cool blank page, aching with anticipation. I want to tattoo your flesh with blue fiery kisses, permanent and indelible as my love for you. I want to woo you with euphony, sweetly seduce you with the sultry sway of my assonance and consonants. Tonight will not be a haiku, though brevity can be beautiful too. Tonight we are epic, imaginative imagery, a feast for the senses. I belly dance to a body ballad, do a strip tease to a sexy sestina. I compose iambic pentameter with the boom boom, boom boom of my hips. My intentions more concrete, I finger paint patterns on your body and my colors, fill in the spaces with free verse nibbles, with meter and control the syllables flow with the right inspiration and the proper pen strokes. Starting with a central concept and working my way out, I test out your sound in my mouth, moans and groans of of onomatopoeia as I taste each part. Focusing on good diction, I twine my tongue around you like a simile, weaving you in stanzas of ecstasy until you are the metaphor, and still I want more. My call, your response, you flick flick my lips quickly with skillful alliteration, and I firmly grasp your meaning. We get symbolic, all phallic and yonic, freakier than any dirty limerick, and a million times wilder than any exaggeration hyperbolic, with creative collaboration we become a closed couplet, an interlocking rhyme, and finding a balance between breath and rhythm, we build momentum with purpose towards expression. We reinforce the rising action with repetition. We reinforce the rising action with repetition. We reinforce the rising action with repetition until we erupt in spoken word, lost in the perfect moment of pure performance art, the ultimate earth-shattering slam poem where there is no time penalty for taking longer than three minutes. <laughs> and when all is said and done, the vehicle exhausted to its logical conclusion, our final resolution written upon our fluttering eyelids, I rise from the bed, reach for my pen, and happily award you a ten, a ten, and a ten. 